Baseball players tend to be a superstitious bunch, and the Hawks are no exception. Boise's lost five straight, four to Tri-City, meaning it's time to try something different. Manager Gary Van Tol did that tonight, tweaking his batting order and putting four guys on his lineup card that didn't start yesterday. One of them is obvious, the pitcher, Dayeen Ree, who took the hill in a rehab stint. He takes a line drive off his backside here, and to make matters worse, Ree can't get the out. He seems shaken up. Switching pitchers in the first inning, not a change Van Tol would have wanted to make, but thankfully Ree stayed in the game. It was still scoreless entering the bottom half. David Bodie leading off instead of Sean Dunstan Jr. Bodie, 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 Bodie rocking everywhere. Over 400 feet to dead center and gone. The Hawks go up 1 0. A little later, Ronnie Rodriguez slaps a seeing eye single to left. Two on with two outs for Jose Dore. It looks like he's going to ground out to end the threat, but the Tri City first baseman picks a bad time to show off his juggling act. That loads him up for the six foot six catcher, Kale Brockmeyer. First pitch to him, hits him. I guess he's a pretty big target. That plates Jacob Rogers in its two zip after one. Ree went three scoreless in his first rehab stint. Loiger Padron threw the next three. Gotta love a little Padron on a Monday night. That last check, the Hawks looked like they're gonna snap that streak up 11 2 in the ninth.